Good Monday morning, students. This, today's video is a little different. Um, I have something I want to show you, but the way my camera works, I have to start it in the... I can't screen flip it while I'm filming because I don't have the time to figure that out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just pray, and then we'll get started. I'll keep this short. Lord, thank you for this, these last few weeks of school. I ask that you would be with my students as they write. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, so today what I'm going to show you is simply the sample research report that I have right here for you. And the whole point of this is I just kind of want to flip through this folder and show you what I expect it to look like. So obviously you're going to have a blank notebook folder. Sorry. It is not going to say anything on the front. Mine says sample, but yours will be blank. This folder is going to have three metal prongs on the inside to which you will bind your report. This one does not uh, because I do not have one of those and I cannot go out and get one right now. So when you open the folder, you're going to see a couple things. So you're going to please imagine that these are three hole punched and that there are three metal prongs and it's all bound together in one thing. So here we have our note cards and you should have all the note cards that you have made and I want them tucked into this pocket of your report. Uh, okay, so the first page will be your title page. The back of it is going to be blank. Now, after the title page, which your grammar book, your grammar Abeka book, shows you exactly how to set that up, um, and I want you to follow that, but on here it will be something like you'll have your title, and I think right underneath, although it might be down here in this section of the page, you will have um, your name, the class it's for, and the date on it. Okay, turning the page here, do, 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 do. getting into the body. If you want to double print on both sides of these pages, you are welcome to. If you don't want to figure that out, I also don't care. So the body of the report is going to be the next thing in your notebook. And your report is going to start at the top of the page. There will be no header, nothing. Just go straight into the body. Okay? Body. And the ideal length of this is probably four to five pages. I have, I think, five, yeah, five pages here. It's the body of report. And when, as soon as it's done, the very next page is going to be your works cited. And as I explained in the email, the difference between works cited and bibliography is very small. Um, but throughout the body of your report, should you make a claim or quote information that is not common knowledge? Um, so if you make a specific claim about, say, Henry Clay, that is not common knowledge, you have to cite it, meaning you'll make a little note in the body of your report, and then at the very end, you're going to write all your citations down, okay? You should, I have, I have a feeling that there will be citations for all your reports. Um, I made notes on your drafts this week, so, um, but if for some strange reason you don't cite anything, which is possible, the works cited in the bibliography page are going to be identical, okay? Um, in the sense, well, okay, let me explain. So if you don't cite anything, I'm pretty sure that this would just be blank. <laughs> um, honestly, though, I actually want you to put in, like, whatever's on, whatever books you use to make your note cards. And if you use that information in the body of your report, it goes on this works cited page. Okay, and then your bibliography is going to be a list of everything that you used to make this report happen. Um, not just the stuff that you cited, but everything that you read. Um, and that is basically it. So it's pretty simple. Um, you guys should have all these things together. I wish you great luck. Um, I will be praying for you all. The reports are due next Monday. And I believe that's the 11th of May. This Monday, May the 4th, you must turn in your grammar pages. And if you so choose, you can film yourself uh, doing your monologue and I will give you extra credit. So May the 4th, grammar pages, an extra credit monologue if you want. May the 11th, the full report in my hands or mailbox, May 11th. And I will personally be returning these to you. So don't worry about that. They're really cool. 
Um, and that's it. Uh, I think that we have one more class after that, uh, one more tiny assignment, and we will be done. So God bless you all and have a great week.